St. David's Pipes. Happy St. David's Day. March 1st. It is the patron saint of Wales, St. David. And this is the day he is remembered by the Welsh throughout the world, Welsh Americans, Welsh Canadians, and those of Welsh descent all over. And in Wales, this is celebrated. And when I grew up, we celebrated it in my home. My dad was born and raised in Wales and came to this country at the age of 19 with the equivalent of $5 in his pocket. And he settled in Columbus, Ohio, learned the art of stonemasoning, met my mother at a Welsh festival in Cleveland, Ohio, and my mom was from Aliquippa, born to Welsh parents, and they settled down here. Anyway, St. David. So what we're going to do is we're going to learn a little bit about St. David. St. David was a Welsh bishop born in the 6th century. They claim he was born from 462 uh, to 512. He died in 569. He was canonized in 1123. There's a major shrine at St. David's Cathedral in Pembrokeshire, Wales. And by the way, I have reading glasses now because the cataract surgery, I need reading glasses. They're just $5 cheaters. Okay, he was renowned for his teaching and founding monastic settlements and churches throughout Wales. He was known as the water drinker because he would not drink beer or cider or milk, goat's milk, whatever was popular. His symbol was the leek, and daffodils is also his symbol because that's the national flower of Wales. Now, these leeks and these daffodils are worn as pins on St. David's Day uh, by those who choose to do so. His last words were, Brothers and sisters, be joyful and keep your faith and creed. Do the little things you heard me do and talk about. And as for me, I will walk the path that our fathers have trod before us. Do ye the little things. A miracle was attributed to him. He was preaching the gospel of Christ, the good news, and a nice-sized hill was formed beneath his feet as he preached. Take it or leave it. And I would like to read a poem today by famous Welsh poet Dylan Thomas, who died in New York City at a very young age from alcoholism. And here's one of his poems. And it is entitled Fern Hill. Now as I was young and easy under the apple boughs, about the lifting house and happy as the grass was green, the night above the dingle starry, time let me hail and climb, golden in the heydays of his eyes, and honored among wagons, I was prince of the apple towns. And once below a time, I lordly had the trees and leaves, trail with daisies and barley, down the rivers of the windfall light. And I was green and carefree, famous among the barns, about the happy yard and singing as the farm was home. In the sun that is young once only, Time let me play and be golden in the mercy of his means. And green and golden I was huntsman and herdsman, the calves sang to my horn, the foxes on the hills barked clear and cold, and the Sabbath rang slowly, and the pebbles of the holy streams. All the sun, sun long it was running, it was lovely, the hay fields high as the house, the tunes from the chimneys it was air and plain and lovely and watery, 
and fire green as grass. And nightly under the simple stars, as I rode to sleep, the owls were bearing the farm away. All the moon long I heard, bless among the stables, the night jars, flying with the ricks and the horses flashing into the dark. And then to awake and the farm like a wanderer white with the dew, come back and cock on his shoulder. It was all shining. It was Adam and Maiden. The sky gathered again and the sun grew round that very day. So it must have been after the birth of the simple light. In the first spinning place, the spellbound horses walking warm out of the whiny green stable on the fields of praise and honored among the foxes and pheasants by the gay house under the new-made clouds and happy as the heart was long. In the sun born over and over, I ran my heedless ways. My wishes raced through the house high hay and nothing I cared at my sky blue trades that time allows in all his tuneful turning so few and such morning songs before the children green and golden follow him out of grace nothing i cared in the lamb white days the time would take me up to the swallow throng loft by the shadow of my hand in the moon that it was also rising nor that riding to sleep i should hear him fly with the high fields and wake to the farm forever fled from the childish land oh as i was young and easy in the mercy of his means time held me green and dying though i sang my chains like the sea poems of dylan thomas if you're wondering this is a welsh rugby shirt and this is Cymru, and that is the Welsh word for Wales, Cymru. So, happy St. David's Day to you. I do this video in honor of my late father, my late mother, proud Welsh Americans. Thank you for stopping by. Have a good day.